What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. You know, I posted this earlier. This is going to be a consumer review of MuscleTech's new website. A lot of you guys, if you follow my channel, you know we're big supporters of MuscleTech. They are supporters of Sleepy Dog, so it is a healthy relationship. Um, they recently redid their... It's, I mean, it's been a while now, but it's like... Their website's still practically new. Um, they've done a lot of updating, um, and for the record, we will update this video later, um, just for the fact that, you know, they were kind enough to let me know that they do have new training, new studies, um, you know, new website updates coming soon. So, this is just a review of the website as of now, because a lot of people don't realize that, like, some companies don't change or evolve. Some companies don't care about their consumers. Some companies don't, you know, don't give a shit about us, you know. And Muscle Tech's one of those companies where, like, I mean, we all remember the 90s marketing. I'll try and put some here. <laughs> um, if I can find some. Uh, the old school cell tech hardcore commercials. Um, you know, hang on, my cat's getting this into something. Yeah, they're back in my cat, sir. Let me, move, let me just move my fucking desk. Let's do this video raw. You know, we won't edit anything out. Who cares? This is what you guys follow me for, right? The real content. There we go. And, um, a lot of, a lot of companies don't, don't take pride in growing their business. You know, and I've been a, I've been muscle tech since day one. I mean, my first tub of of a product was an ex four like three or four year expired tub of Celtech Hardcore. If you guys go look at my Celtech review, um, you know you can. I mean, that's go go check that out. I mean, you know that's a product that I actually stand by. You know, um, does you know it's got me that got me started into lifting. Um, hang on one second. Oh. Becky, if you eat my headphones, I'm gonna thump you in the face. My cat's trying to eat my razor headphones. <laughs> um, you know, their website might not seem like a big deal, but guys, I mean, we've all been there. Like, I tried to order stuff from them in the past, like online, and it was so difficult to do. Um, let's get on here and see. I'll post some clippets of me, uh, looking through their website. Um, just because, um, I'm not good at editing and I'm not good at, um, OBS software. So anybody wants, uh, to link down in the description some OBS for dummies, you know, holla at you boy because I suck at this shit. Do, 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 do. Well, if I can find their website, MuscleTech.com. Their legit website. Hmm. By the way, guys, if you don't know, MuscleTech is BOGO at MuscleAndStrength.com. If you buy a product online, write in the comments that Sleepy Dog Fitness sent you. You're part of the Purple Dragon Swole Tank Army. Muscle Tech Strength Defined, we found the website. We just had to scroll down a little bit. So, this website's pretty easy to navigate now. I don't know what kind of changes they plan on doing to their website. You know, um, I'm going to give them my honest feedback of how the website is now. So, when you pull up to this website, and I'll have some clippets of me scrolling through somewhere on the, sc on my, on the screen but obviously you see Henry Cavill, like he's, you know, he's part of Team Muscle Tech. How cool is that? Man of Steel takes Muscle Tech. It's good enough for me to take it. So, I love their new logo. Like, it just, it's so much cleaner than the old stuff. And I mean, I remember the old stuff. Muscle Tech. Supplements that work. Backed by science. I mean, 
they've always had great marketing. Let's 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 just be real. I mean, they've always catered to that bodybuilding. I mean, name a one Mr. Olympia that wasn't sponsored by Muscle Tech. Like, a good one. I mean, not to name drop a few, but Jay, Jay Cutler is my favorite. Um, so it starts off, you can click on, obviously, uh, learn more about Henry Cavalier. You can click on that. At the top of their website, I do like how they keep it simple. Products, journal, about us, more. You know, you can scroll through the tabs if you want. You can log into your own profile that you can set up. You can scroll down you can see that they're doing this nest athlete search um which i highly recommend you go check out also you can put in your information and get a five dollar off of a shatter ripped at your local gnc um i don't know if you guys have seen it but i highly go recommend go check out my review um that's probably the best pre-workout for somebody on a cut and somebody who is prone to anxiety and depression, personally. Um, as you scroll down through their website, you can see their Muscle Tech Journey uh, journal, which has like their nutrition, their training, the summer beach body muscle program, their back by science ways to lean out for summer, because it's summertime, guys. You can keep scrolling, you can choose your fit, um, I have noticed by looking at this, and it could be for some reason that when I, I took my shot screenshots, it was on my phone. The website, if you do get on a laptop, compared to the mobile version, the one on the laptop is just so much more clean as um, far as scrolling down. I noticed that if you're trying to scroll through this website on your phone, Sometimes it'll like scroll back up on you. And it could just be that my phone's a piece of shit. It's not anything to do with their website. I'm just giving you guys honest feedback. You know, obviously their brand mission, you know, Muscle Tech was born out of a session of be redefined, limits of science and human potential. Um, they do have a very good commitment to research. Like I'll vouch for, I'll vouch for that. Like I remember when Muscle Tech products literally had stacks and stacks and stacks of hardcore matrixes and um back when you could get the uh, Luca, Gakic and Cricket stacks um that were ungodly expensive but I bought that shit um you guys really should bring that back even though technically you can get that same stack like literally comparable to Luca, you could just do you some clear muscle like it's you could do you some Celtech Elite um some clear muscle and some nano x9 and you practically have that stack sort of bring back gacket guys i know it was eight huge ass horse pills but it was bomb um let's see find the right product this is what i thought was cool so you can actually take their quiz to find out particular supplements for you a lot of companies are doing this i know gnc does it but theirs kind of suck um, uh, like I like how they allow you to do it on the website in a more user friendly way. Um, also go follow them on Instagram. Um, I am very honored to say they follow Sleepy Dog Fitness, and I obviously follow them and every athlete that they have. <laughs> you know, you can get them on Instagram, TikTok. Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. They also do podcasts, too, by the way. I do like that they make sure that you know. Like, you'll see this a lot through scrolling through their website. Look for their sticker. So, Muscle Tech being a... I consider them a worldwide brand. You know, back... It's probably been, like, middle 2000s. Like they had a lot of issues with with people stealing their shit. Like you, they, you go buy their shit, and if you bought it on eBay, like you're getting fake product. Like it wasn't what the real. I can't tell you how many times that I've seen somebody open a tub of like Phase Eight, and it looked like fucking um, flour and cocoa mix, and it wasn't even Phase Eight protein powder. So like with all of their new stuff, you literally all you have to do 
is download their free app. You can get it in the um, uh, Play Store, Apple, whatever. I don't have an iPhone, so you know we're classy over here. We have Androids, um, but just just download their free app. And all of the products now come with a holographic sticker. You can actually scan. You can even scan some of their older barcodes, if I'm not mistaken, their QR codes. And it'll let you know if it's a legit muscle tech product. In 2022, that is highly busted. Um, also, the cool thing about this website is... Not only how user friendly, but the fact that they bombard you with tons of free information that are all backed by science, of course, clinical studies, research, trials, experience, stuff like that. But like just even scrolling down, it's like I have three links here where I can click on for five stretches for lower back pain, five quality exercise for your glutes, and and then I can even click on a hundred percent mass gain to go look at that product. Also. You can um, sign up with them. You can subscribe to their emails, and you get ten bucks off from the Muscle Tech store. Like you know, that'd take your thirty, forty dollar pre workout and drop you ten bucks. Most places, that's going to save you all of your tax. You know, um, depending on where you live at. You continue to scroll to the bottom. The cool thing is, I will say I do much would rather look at their website on the laptop than on my phone, for the fact that me personally, I set all of my stuff to black on my phone which sometimes makes it a little harder to look at websites but if you get on their website on a laptop like at the when you if you just can't find anything say you're an idiot at electronics you can literally scroll to the bottom they have everything organized so you can click on products you can look at protein powder pre-workout post-workout weight loss apparel you know um guys go get you some muscle tech swag you know Chaz um so a lot of you guys, if you want some backstory, like I made my now ex-wife drive us all the way to Pittsburgh from Alabama to do an event with Muscle Tech when they did a Tough Mudder up there. I'll try and put some photos somewhere up here because I had a blast. Um, and yes, I will do that again if you guys want me to. Um, but I drove all the way to Pittsburgh to help out my buddy Chaz. Uh, he used to work with Ivy. He works for Compound Solutions now. Chaz, shout out to you, boy. You big dog. You, you fam. Um, and uh, so we go help him out at this tough one. Right? Drove all the way there from Alabama, which is like shit. It was like sixteen or nineteen hours, you know, um, to help him out with an event. And I, I would do that again in a heartbeat. Um, I kind of lost my train of thought because this is post-workout and it's like 11.40 in the States. As, as you guys can tell, we don't sleep. Anyway, let's continue. Oh, as far as their apparel. Back to, I remembered what I was talking about. I remember showing up in a muscle tech jacket that I got from Libby. Um, and I remember Jazz was like, Bro, you have more swag for Muscle Tech than I do, and I fucking work here. Guys, go to MuscleTechShop.com or go to Muscle and Strength and get you some of the barbell shirts. Like, the apparel is nice. Just, if you buy the shirts from Muscle and Strength, from experience, try to get, like, two sizes larger because they are pre-shrunk for mediums. Um, so, if you like a douchey V-neck, they're perfect. Um, Their content. This is the cool part. So, like... They're doing what a lot of companies should do. Like, I know Mark Lobliner from Tiger Fitness. Um, you can buy their, some of Muscle Tech's products from TigerFitness.com, but um, they also do stuff like this. So they do their journal. They give you training, nutrition, researches, athletes, podcasts, their Verify app, all on their website. So, like, if you want to look at a particular study off of a product, like, you literally can find, even like if you want to do the actual like training for like your clear muscle, like you can find it all on the website. The cool part is they also include their customer service, which most companies are going to hide that from you. So I like that they're being transparent. You have your account that you can click on. You can contact them directly. Um, they do repost stories. Um, obviously, they're not going to post anything vulgar or, or anything like that. But if you do have a question on their supplements, feel free to DM them. Like, they're super nice. They'll get back to you. 
you know, or DM anybody that works with them. Everybody from that company has always been super nice to me. Um, but I do know that you literally can ask them whatever you want. And you can even do it on the website. Facts. You can look up facts about your product. They'll also show you the nearest place to buy your stuff if you don't want to buy online. They also have international distributors, unapproved dist distributors, and counterfeit stuff. So if you're worried if your shit's fake. And they also have the countries and stuff they swear about. All that's at the bottom. So let's scroll back up to the top. The very top. And... Hmm. Let's click on... Click on research. Sorry if my computer's a little slow. It's a HP Pavilion. So I like when you click on. That's one thing I've all I can always say about IV, like they or Muscle Tech. They've always been big on research. They have a fascinating research facility. Oh, it'd be cool if you guys would fly your dog, your buddy Sleepy Dog Fitness out there for just so I can hang out in 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 y'all's um you know badass gym you got and then one of those eggs. Um they have a research budget on here. I like that you can just kind of look up the history of their stuff just by clicking on research. Let's look at products category. It's pretty easy to find stuff. Pre-workout, intra-workout, branch chains, testosterone, apparel. Choose your fit. Hmm. The only hard, irritating thing I can say about their online website is it was easier on my mobile device to find your diet stuff than it was, than it has been. Let's click on nutrition. Oh, yeah, I was just clicking on the wrong shit. That's my bad. So you can click on nutrition, and you can literally, like, you have, you can ask some questions on here, active lifestyle supplementation. I'm just going to scroll down. Four great sleep supplements for athletes, the science behind baiting. Hey, if you guys want a video on baiting, I actually wrote a term paper in college on baiting. Don't ask me why. Ironically, I also wrote a term paper on Bram Stoker's Dracula, the his view of modern day feminism. My teacher asked to keep that, even though my spelling was rough. I made 80, 87 on that. As you guys can always tell, my grammar's pretty rough. Hmm. Weight gain meal plan. Let's see. I want. Implementation here, recipes. Hmm. Let's click on weight gain meal plan. Why not? Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. So I like that it it'll just it they literally tell you all the science on here. So if you click on weight gain meal plan, it'll tell you what what's healthy. You know what you should do, what you shouldn't do. It gives you a Pretty much like a a paraphrased nutritional outline to make your own program. And no, guys, everything on their website, far as like information, is free. Like you, this is three thousand calorie meal plan. Tells you exactly what to eat. Like I'm looking at it right now: one cup of oats, one cup of dairy, plant-based or plant-based milk, one banana, two tablespoons of peanut butter. That's a pretty good breakfast. There we go. More from Muscle Tech. Summer Beach Body Muscle Building Program. That's the one we want to click on. As you guys know, I'm prepping for a physique show. I'm currently 23 weeks out to watch the video. Um, let's get our shirt in here. Um, ironically, thanks, Chaz. I think you're the one that gave me this particular shirt. Um, I would have wore my new logo shirt, but I kind of want to wear it to the gym tomorrow, so I'm wearing this one. I almost wore 
old school hardcore one I got. Man, y'all guys need to bring back a hardcore apparel apparel line. That'd be dope. Do like an anniversary year thing or something. Um. So we're going to compare their summer beat shredding diet to like, say like for me, like I'm on a contest prep. Obviously, like I have a particular nutritional goal I have to meet. Um. And so let's see, meal plan. This is for the muscle building summer beach body. Like you want to look like Frank Zane style of diet. Let's see, meal one. Um, one cup of egg white omelet with half a cup of spinach. Okay, okay. So <clears throat> definitely look this up on a laptop because I can tell you that on my phone, it wouldn't give me the option to scroll over. So I couldn't, I could only see like, 70% of this meal plan and I think that's just a mobile phone thing and I was also recording my screen so like I couldn't necessarily turn my phone uh, to the wide view so I like how like ingredient var variations 100 gram turkey breast two slices of Ezekiel toast they even give you options like I mean I've known people to write meal plans that ain't as good as this and this is free Look, meal three. Now, this is for a 175-pound meal. Adjust calories appropriately for your size. Now, obviously, I'm down to 205. You know, my largest guys, um, oh, it's 260. I'll try and post a photo up here somewhere. Um, so, like, let's just say, like, well, right now on my contest prep, I'm eating six ounces. You know, um, and this... This is about six, like, meal two, six ounces of roasted chicken breast, boneless and skinless, one cup of vegetables. You can also swap the chicken for turkey. That's a good, that's a good solid meal. You know, let's see. Meal six, one plain rice cake with one tablespoon of natural peanut butter. Ten ounces of walnuts with half a cup of Greek yogurt. I'm not a big fan of rice cakes unless they're the really shitty apple cinnamon ones. Um, I would probably do the yogurt bowl. But this is this was my favorite part of looking at this, the trainer tips. Do not eat if you are not hungry. The most people like might take this for granted, but if you're new to lifting or if you're a novice or honest with you, you just need to try something new. Like these are good tips. <laughs> like, do not eat if you're not hungry. Don't snack. You are allowed one cheat meal per week because you're human. You know, drink a minimum of two to three uh, liters of water a day. That's a good water requirement. You know, use sugar-free hot sauce to flavor your meat. Low calories. Um, add cinnamon and spices to increase flavor. Like. Those are all solid tips. Let's get into the good stuff. Training program. Let's see. All right, here's the overview. Chest plus 30 minutes of cardio. Back, 30 minutes of cardio. Wednesday, abs, calves, 30 minutes of cardio. Thursday, shoulders, 30 minutes of cardio. Friday, arms, 30 minutes of cardio. Saturday, legs, and Sunday's a rest day. That's not a bad split. Like, would you consider that a pro split? Like, I feel like that's a pro split. 100%. Because I'm assuming by reading this, yeah, yeah, it's, it's listed. If you do this in order, I'm assuming that chest plus 30 minutes of cardio, they're expecting you to do your cardio post-workout. Um, Like, say, Monday for chest. Incline dumbbell press, 3 sets, 8 to 12 reps. Flat dumbbell press, 3 sets, 8 to 12 reps. Um... Decline dumbbell press, low incline dumbbell chest flies. That's a good workout. Like, if you do that, like, so, like, I feel like this is, like, SSIT training. You know, you guys know I'm a big component of German volume, but this is a very good, it's very good training. Like, the fact that this is free, like, you can make some gains with this. Um, you can be strong as fuck. Back. Let's see, abs. I like their back workout, like weighted chin-ups, three sets of eight to 12 reps. 
if you guys follow have been following my contest prep you know last month i actually were doing something like that but for like my activation exercises because it really you can get a really good pump in your in your lats if you if you do that first abs and calves it's always a good day shoulders arms legs and a rest day <clears throat> and then they also give you trainer notes sets reps three to four sets of eight to twelve um eight to twelve reps with same weight this is a little confusing it could just be that i'm reading this wrong but I'm assuming your first two sets you do increase in weight and then you decrease in weight. I don't really know what this quote like absolute symbol plus plus slash negative two means. Um, I, I can see where that could be a little irritating to look at. But how I would read it is sets or reps. Three to four sets of eight to twelve reps. I'm assuming that you probably increase your weight and then decrease your weight. To failure. That's how I would read that. Rest between set 60 seconds. Tempo slow and controlled with constant constant ten, fuck, tension. That's cardio interval training. Okay. That's the style of cardio you like. I like this. For free? Like. If this video gets a shit ton of views. Like. Not even a shit ton. If we can get this video a thousand views. I will do this training style their supplement stack and their diet for a whole month uh, it probably be after my show but i will do supplement stack on um, platinum whey plus muscle builder that is the, one of their new proteins i have not done a review on it um as you guys know i'm big on the nitro tech elite and right now with my contest prep i'm doing the nitro tech rip it's just more suited for my goal um and the taste is it's a good, good chocolate flavor. Um, I'll post a photo here. Go buy you some. Tell them Sleepy Dog sent you. Uh, so they have that. Um, builds muscle, rapid post-workout amino acid recovery. Tastes great. Um, I'm, it's a muscle tech protein powder. It probably tastes great. Um, Hydroxycut Hardcore Elite. Those I will vouch for. Now I am doing the Super Elite. Um, the only... I don't, I don't know if I've done a high, just a Hydroxycut Elite review yet for the original one. Um, I have to go back and look. Uh, but I will post the review I did for the Elite one here. I highly recommend the Elite one over the regular one. The stimulants in it are f way phenomenal, and I just think it would be a better fit for this. Um, lose weight, increase energy for your workout, 100%. <laughs> Trainer notes. Avoid taking hydroxycut hardcore elites five hours before bed, bedtime. Just for you novices out there, most caffeine is out of your system in five hours. Do not be like Sleepy Dog and you can ask my date I had the other night. We were eating supper at 11 o'clock and I was drinking a hydroxycut RTD with my supper. I'm built different, bro. Built different. Um, more from Muscle Tech. I like that they also include body weight stuff. You know, they have something on their website literally for about everybody. Um, grow your calves into cows. Hell yeah. 30 minute chest workout, top 10 killers and how to correct them. Don't, f and I like how they plaster like all of their savings on here. That just makes you want to buy something. Let's look at some products. Now shopping on here has improved so much guys. Like, I know y'all are going to do some like, crazy website changes. Um, you know, shout out to Muscle Tech for, you know, sliding in my DMs today uh, and letting me know that. <laughs> um, so, I don't know what their big plans are because, like, their website's pretty good. Um, the interface as far as buying your products now are a lot easier because, man, I remember, like, before the whole marketing swap over... Like, it was a it was a bitch to buy stuff off their website, and now they literally pull up a picture. Um, which one do I want to click on? Um, I'm just gonna click on one and see how long it takes to load. Bam, big ass fucking photo of shattered ripped pre workout. Buy now, thirty four ninety nine. You can click buy now. 
use options. Rainbow Candy or IC Rocket. Add a card. It's super easy. Don't forget to sign up for their rewards and perks. It's just so good to be able to actually like navigate through a website. Um, so you can also do the product quiz. How active are you? We're super active. Runner, play, work out in the gym. What do you want to focus on right now? I might not have video of this, but but you can do it. Hmm. Also, sorry guys, I'm kind of tired. Um, the cool thing, if you scroll to the bottom, you can click on podcast. So. Obviously, they do post a little bit on YouTube. I'm not sure if Muscle Tech follows me on YouTube, but they should. <laughs> Thank you for following my TikTok. Um, you guys still need to follow my Twitter. But their stories of strength is their podcast. And um, I've listened to a little bit of it. Obviously, I also have a podcast, so go listen to mine. I'll put a link to a video here. Mine's Purple Dragon Soul Tank Radio. But their stories of, sh of strength, you can get on Apple Podcast. You can listen to it on Spotify, Google Podcasts, which I didn't even know Google had podcasts. Like, that's dope. Amazon Music, I highly recommend Amazon Music. Um, it's like Spotify and Pandora had a baby, but it's better. And it's if you have Amazon Prime, it's like $1.99 a month. Uh, Overcast, CastBox, and Radio Public. So, like, they're literally on... All the good podcasts. Um, I'm pretty positive you could probably listen to them on here. I'm assuming you can because I can't. It does let me click on it. Um, but they have stuff like redefining strength through technology. Um, refusing to submit. That was a good one with Tori Wilson. Um, staying calm and motivated. These are just good podcast to listen to especially if you're like on your way to work and stuff and get tired of listening to the same anime hit music um you can also stay informed with muscle tech they want me to put in my name and email it should already be in here uh good good stuff you can also search on their website let's let's try and search something let's see how easy this is Put this Razer keyboard to the test. That that's that's a good search. Diet products, and then it literally pulls up five pages of stuff you can click through. Good website, good website. I love their marketing. Their their logo is just it's it's dope. Their new logo is clean. Um, what to give this website rating i know this has been a longer video but i just kind of wanted to walk through this website and give my thoughts on it i don't really have major takeaways i feel like they need to do they need to make a better mobile version of this website i just know that the the clips that you'll see in this video i recorded on my phone and it was a little difficult to do really just to navigate through on a mobile device on a laptop is down pat. Um, I am excited to see what new um, research and studies that they put on their website. Sleepy Dog rating for their website. Hmm. I'm going to give it an 8.1 out of 10. Um, that's the Sleepy Dog seal of approval. Things they could do better. Um, change your background from white to black, maybe. Um, or that royal purple looks dope. Nah, I mean, just make the mo make it easier to, to, to view your website on a mobile device. Other than that, I have no complaints. Like, it's super smooth looking through this. Man, I remember trying to order stuff on their website back in the day, and it would take me like an hour. 
you know, so this new website is just so much better. I love all the free nutritional stuff that's on here. You can even look at the tech that they like that's on here. You know, um, I mean, they really went, they kind of went, oh, hydroxy cut weight loss RTD. We'll be doing a review. Um, go check that out too. Anyway, um, just make a, I wish you guys would make a really badass mobile version of this website. Condense it a little bit, but other than that, I have no complaints. Just because I remember y'all's original website. You know, and just to see how far they've came as a company. Like, not only did you really get shit on in the past with all your, like, crazy marketing. That was all backed by science. It was, you know, it was might have been stretched a little bit. I've been muscle tech since day one, so I can say it. Um, but just to see a company grow and develop and do it for their customers. You know, that's one, one reason why I can say that I'll always take muscle tech products is because I remember, you know, back when hydroxy cut was the real hydroxy cut, you know, white bottle, rainbow riding, you know, they had to redo it. You know, they had all these matrices. Some of their stuff didn't taste the best. They redid it. They redid their line. They redid their marketing campaign. You know, they just constantly grown and gotten better over the years you know it's one of the reasons they've led the industry as far as you know bodybuilding supplements for a long time you know and i love that that doing more functionally fit stuff for just your everyday athlete too but the fact that they're trying to drill it in your head that like this is a lifestyle like muscle tech is a lifestyle you know um Kudos for that because a lot of companies wouldn't do that. They would just try and sell you some snake oil bullshit and not try and help you get to your goals. You know, you even get recipes on here. Let's click on that and see what we got. Holiday protein pancake recipe, no baked chocolate energy balls. I think that was on one of their Christmas specials on YouTube, but I'm not sure. But those were good because I've made those before. Mocha Coffee Kickstarter. My God, my God, I will try that. They have like 12 pages of recipes on here. You pretty much get a free cookbook on this website. Like, I highly recommend you guys subscribe to this. Like I said, I know y'all are going to think that I'm biased because, I mean, if you follow me, you know I'm, I'm a diehard muscle tech guy. You know, um, we'll be repping them all the way to the, to the very end of my show. So, you know, um, who knows? Maybe some of them will be there. But, um, eight, what I say, 8.1? We'll go 8.2. The recipes, recipes, it's just, it's just such great that, like, a company's going out of their way to make sure that you can actually hit your, your goals. So, if you guys haven't checked out their website, I highly recommend you do. I'm not going to make this video an hour long. It'll probably be an hour long by the time I get done editing it, but... I'll try and condense it as much as possible for you guys. But just know, definitely go check out their new website. Definitely go back and check it out when they do all their upgrades to it that they're probably going to do. But for a website for a company, like, I don't know who does their website, but kudos to them because they've done a hell of a job. It's clean. It's super easy to read. It's not, like, jumbled up. Um, your boy likes. Stay classy.